Hello everybody, this is Fragger here on how to get the pacifist achievement and the only bullet that you get to fire in Half-Life 2 Episode 1 in order to get the one free bullet achievement. Now, let's see if this fading here works, and yeah, we do. Now, in this zone here, you gotta fire off that one ball, or, you know, miss, because it's so hard for me to get balls and holes. So, what you do is you fire that ball in that socket, it goes in, it doesn't fully lock, because right now as I'm grabbing a second one, He's removing it. Now, if I took any longer, I would have fallen to my death, because, you know, I'm a slow asshole here. Grab another one, fire it into that hole there. Now those two are completely locked. Now you run across, hoping to push that button, and what's it tell us? Oh, shit, you don't get it. So you gotta do now. So what you do is you grab another one, fire it in the very first area, now you gotta run over and push the button. Now, once the button's pressed, the balls are completely locked the stalkers there can't remove them. So what you gotta do now is you gotta climb it on up and once you climb up it doesn't pop but you are pretty much in the area where there's no more stalkers so don't worry about killing stalkers or doing anything like that from now on. Now from here I'm actually going to pop and pop forward in the level and show you where you do get the achievement. There it is. So now we're just gonna continue on from here. Now, I just finished drinking my 40, and I'm all like, I'm too drunk to do this. Well, Gordon Freeman's never too drunk. And then, oh, go guard, I shot that in your eyes. So what you gotta do now is you gotta move shit out of the way, go into the air duct, and you little joke. About you and air ducts. Dr. Kleiner says whenever he locked himself out of his office, you and Barney used to compete to see who could get in fastest without using a key. Well, the keys are for bitches, so what you do here is I grab this flare here just to show you guys that that's what ends up happening with a flare. Now, once you grab a flare, it, it ignites. Now, to get the zombie queue achievement later on, you gotta remember the fact that these flares, once you grab them with a grab gun or grab them in general, they ignite, so be very, very wary of that. Don't ignite a flare unless you really mean to. Now, you drop down, and hold crap, it's a head crab, just like a Tijuana. So what do you do just like a Tijuana? You hit the crab with a folding chair. That's the best way to get rid of crabs. So, what you do here is you spin around in a circle and throw boxes against walls. I take it. I guess I really was drunk when I was making this video. Now, you don't want the shotgun. No. What you do is, wait, where'd it go? Oh no, that's just energy. I want that, the Tomb Raider pistol. So you grab this pistol, and here's the part that's very, very important. You go up to the lock there, now you pause the game, you save your game, because this is what smart people do, and make sure, because I've done it actually myself, I've actually missed, so what you do is, take a shot, there you go. That's your one free bullet. That's it. You get nothing else. So, from that point on, don't fire the grenade launcher part of your, um, your assault rifle, because that will count. You don't fire the energy ball from the combine rifle. You don't do anything like that. You can own and you can specifically only use the handheld grenades, the RPG launcher, the crowbar, and the grav gun. Keep that in mind. Okay? Have a good day, guys, and I'll be back a little later on with a zombie Q achievement. Thanks. Totals.